You open up a newspaper, you see a headline in that newspaper. You see a headline on a website. You see headlines on advertising cards that come in your mailbox. And we want to we want to put this headline into you in here. It says how to get ahead of 99% of auto shops. So if you wanted to be above everybody else in your marketplace, whether there's 10 shops in your town or in Houston, there's over 7,000 shops. So just give you a rough number. In Bowling Green here, we have 22 automotive repair shops. That's not counting car dealers. So how do you get that 99%? So remember that 99% because that's what we're going after. You want to be ahead of the other 99%. So Cody, in the auto shop marketing that you do uh, on the in the online basis, how, how did how did what you do get them into that prime spot of ninety nine percent better than everybody else? All right, well, basically, um, it's of course what we focus on is online, and it's it's twenty twenty four. It's an online world, and mostly on mobile. Uh, people are doing their research on their phones. Um, that's how they find you. And the question is are they finding you and are they catching their interest? Are you catching their interest when they do? Um, you need to be visible and you need to have credibility. Um, you need to have great customer engagement, which actually can also be mostly automated uh, with what we do. Okay. And um, you need to have that competitive edge, which of course is what we're all building. Yeah. What, what do you say? Uh, what the shop owner we're talking to? Well, we've already got, we've got a website. Yep. We have a Facebook page. We have all this stuff going on and, you know, we're getting pretty decent rankings. We're getting a lot of people, you know, giving us five star rating and three star ratings and all these kinds of things. So to, to move up to that 99% approach, you know, what, how, how do we know what's missing? Absolutely. How do we know so, how we yeah. can get better? Yeah. So that is the question. And that's the one that's really hard to answer for a lot of people. And, you know, where it takes that that knowledge and understanding of somebody that is you know, handling these type of things. And there's there's a lot to it. Um, and what we do is we kind of look at all of those factors that you just mentioned. You know, how is their rankings? How is their reviews? How does their website look? Is it optimized? Uh, we look at all these type of things and we we find out where the strengths are for that business or where the weaknesses are um as well as other implementations that they may have never even heard of like um you know adding missed call text backs and uh re-engagement campaigns and uh, things like citations which um is you know getting your name number and email out there to more various platforms and having it all interconnected which can strengthen your rankings so there's there's a lot of different factors out there um that can improve these things and there's a lot of optimization on the things that they already have. And then, like I said, also incorporating some other things. So when you, you take all this into consideration and uh, you look at it all, you, you start to fine tune it, you know, you start to tweak it just like uh, when you're building a car, you, you know, just put a fresh motor in, maybe you supercharge or turbocharge it, you know, you throw it on the dyno and you start tweaking those numbers and you start figuring out how can I squeeze the most performance out of this car? You know, you're not just going to throw it on the street and hope for the best. You know, you're going to take it to the dyno and you want to do it right. And that's kind of like good. what we're doing here with, with the marketing, with the business. Good, good. So remember, folks, we have five bays. We're looking for five shop owners that are raising their hand and pulling themselves into that bay so Cody can get started helping you. And he's not looking for 5,000 customers. He's looking for five right now. In these oh, yeah. five folks. Yep, absolutely. So, uh, Very personalized. And, you know, if I consider, you know, everybody we work with as a teammate, as a team member to what we do. Um, and it's very, um, like I said, it's personal. So I'm here to help you. We work together and it's all about building up something better for everybody. And for you guys, of course, right. that would be to, uh, you know, get more cars in the bay, to get your reputation out there, to really just Again, like I've said before, you know, it's, it's about the fine tuning and it's something that we do together. And it's not, you know, you're not just a number, you know, I say it's kind of like, um, you know, like we're the pit crew uh, to, let's say you're, you're the race car driver, you're out on the track, you know, we're here, we're the pit crew, we're trying to get your car in, trying to get it fixed up and get it back out on the track as soon as we can. Good, good deal. Okay, this is kind of close out this section, but remember 99% and five bays. That's all we're wanting to feel right now. So don't wait around. Okay. <laughs>